we will see how to install and use the pH meter. First we will take our stand, take the screw off its bottom and insert it into the stand base. Now we will tighten the stand onto the stand base using the screw. We can use the knob on the right side of the stand to change its height. At the back of the instrument, we have the pH electrode socket, temperature probe socket and the power socket. First we will take the temperature probe and insert the connectors into the temperature socket, marked as degree Celsius. Then we will take our pH electrode and attach its connector to the pH socket. Now we will take the power adapter and insert its connector into the socket. Then we will turn on the instrument and take the storage solution bottle off the electrode. Now we will wash the electrode and the temperature probe with distilled water and wipe them with a tissue. First we will enter the settings menu using the up and down buttons. Contrast option lets us set the desired contrast of the screen. It can be changed using the up and down buttons. Language option lets us change the language of the instrument. Erase memory option resets the settings to factory default. Auto off option turns off the instrument after a set amount. Now on the home screen, we will press the cal button to start the calibration process. Here we have calibration solutions that we can use to calibrate the instrument.
we will submerge the electrode and the temperature probe into the 4 pH solution. Now we will press enter, the screen will show Cal 1 and start the calibration procedure. Once the calibration for 4 pH solution ends, the instrument asks you to put the electrode into 7 pH solution. We will then wash the electrode and the temperature probe with distilled water, wipe them with a tissue and submerge them into the 7 pH buffer solution. Then we will press enter to continue calibration. The instrument is asking us to submerge the temperature probe and the electrode into 10 pH solution. We will wash the electrode and the temperature probe with distilled water and wipe them with a tissue. Once calibration ends the screen will show calibration successful. We will press the enter button to proceed.
After calibration, we will wash the electrode and the temperature probe with distilled water and wipe them with a tissue. Here we have a container filled with tap water, we will submerge the pH electrode and the temperature probe into the sample. We will press the down button to save the reading, and note down the serial number reading was saved on. To check the saved reading we will press the up button and use the up and down button to navigate to the serial number we saved the reading on. We will press the on off button to turn off the instrument, your instrument is ready to be used. Thank you.